Hey everybody, Steve Burns here. I want to talk about transferring the default location of your Creative Cloud files from your main hard drive to another drive of your choice. Now I'm working on a Cintiq Companion, which is using a, using a solid state drive of 512 gigabytes. Now I'm limited on space, so I may not want to sync those files from that hard drive. I prefer to use an external drive. Now, by default, on your main C drive and underneath your name, the username, which is in this case, Stephen Burns, you're gonna find your Creative Cloud syncing folder. Now, it's not here because I have already synced it over to my external drive, E drive. There is the Creative Cloud folder. Now, I'm gonna share with you how to go about moving your default sync location from one, from your C drive to a drive of your choice. All right, now, top right hand corner, I'm gonna go to my little quick access. You see this little linking symbol there, which is my Creative Cloud application. I'm gonna target that. And of course, we have our home, we have our apps, and you're always gonna make sure that your apps are up to date here. However, right over here in the top right hand corner are my settings. I'm gonna target that. And I'm also going to target preferences. Once preferences has been activated, I want to target the files. Once the files have been activated, we have the sync on and off. You can choose to turn it on and off. So if you do not want your files syncing every time you drag and drop anything into that folder, then go ahead and turn it off. It'll save you some memory on your, on your, on your system. Here, I've already designated my location to E. I'm going to target the change. And now you can see that my default location is my E drive. And all I needed to do was actually target the root of the drive and it automatically set up a Creative Cloud folder um, natively and for you. All right, so inside that folder, you will see all the additional subfolders and files that I have already designated to be synced to the cloud. All right, so hopefully that has been very helpful and again, if you're limited on hard drive space, but you're using external drives for additional um, you know, storage, then use it, consider using it for syncing your Creative Cloud files. All right, hope you enjoyed this. This is Stephen Burns. More tutorials to come. Enjoy.